In this video, I am going to show you how to model buildings in an easy way. In previous days, when I am new to Blender, I model these buildings. Let me tell you something. They are terrible, the topology is bad, it took a long time to model them, and on top of all of these, my Blender keeps getting crashed due to the high memory usage. So to avoid all of these in my future project, I am going to start modeling in them in a different way. This way worked better than before, so I am here to share it with you. Also the way I am showing you may not be accurate, may not work every time, or it will not be the right way to model at all. But it is just my way of doing things, so feel free to comment or point out my mistakes in the comment section while you are down there. Also make sure to subscribe to the channel, so I can get some moral support. Now coming to the modeling part, I took so many reference images like every professional model will do and started absorbing them. Then I noticed that every building is mostly uniform. That means what I am saying is, if you take this building, the total 5 floors, in these 5 floors, in each floor there, there is some repetitiveness. What I am saying is, this window is common everywhere. This window is separate, we, we should model this separately. Like that, we can take each and every piece as a block, like this, and model them separately with detail, and we can duplicate them. We can make instances of them so that our memory power, our uh, system memory will not become full and our, our blender will not become black. Like that, we can take every piece of the building, model them separately. If they are repeated, we can make instances of them and use them. Like, like this, we can make this porch as a separate model, make this railing as a separate model, these windows, these rooftops as a separate model, and we can attach them separately. Like that, our memory will not become full and our blender will not keep crashing. Hope you are understanding what I am saying. If you don't understand, no problem. We will go to Blender, I will model uh, one block. Then you will understand everything clearly what I am saying. Let's go to modeling part. By any chance, if you are modeling building like this, with no symmetry and no, no repetitiveness, I am sorry, I have never modeled something like this. I don't even know where to start for this one. But eventually I should model this someday. I will tackle this at that time. Now in Blender, I model these parts. I model these three windows, uh, these two decors this railing and uh, these blocks. One more thing while you're doing this process is, you should model these corner pieces and this middle piece separately. Here this is a corner piece and this is a this is a middle piece which goes here. Because if you use the same middle piece as corner pieces, I'll show you what will happen. If I duplicate this, if I make an instance of this piece, you can see proper model building will not form. Here the, uh, these details are not available here. In that case, if I go to edit mode and edit this block, it will also change this block because they are instances. You can also you can also say that you can just duplicate by clicking shift, shift to D and uh, edit them. In that case, there, there is no use of following this method because the blender will take same high memory power. So what we'll do is, in place of this, take off this one and model a separate corner piece. So it will, it will fit prefer, perfectly. You can also reduce the memory power just by taking planes and modeling planes. I took cubes because I I. For suppose if, if I'm using this building in night scene, I want to uh, keep the uh, windows transparent and keep some objects in them and some lights in them. So for extra modeling and, and to add some extra lights, I uh, put these holes and made these blocks. You can also do same thing by using planes. Following that same process, I, mod I model the structure of this building. I did not go into much detail because in the product I'm using, I'm not taking, going to take any close-up shots of this building. Just they'll be in a far away distance. So if I even do much detailing to this high detailing in this building, it will not be visible that much. Now one final block I need to model is this green part here. Just uh, same thing. I should just model one part. I'll make instances of them and just place it on the building. Let's do that now. 